Okay, this video is um, mainly directed to anyone escaping a cult, especially Jehovah's Witnesses, like I was in 40 years. Believing the Messiah was Michael the Archangel incarnated, mea culpa maxima. When I resigned three years ago, I read Hebrews chapter 1 very carefully. Twice in that chapter it says, To which one of the angels, to which one of the angels did God ever say, You're my son? I thought, warning bells. And of course, I read, I read Reverend Francis' books twice. Reverend Franz, the former governing body member. The Trinity is a disgusting demonic spewing. Period. A disgusting demonic spewing. Matthew 16. Verse 14. Well, verse 13 actually. Verse 13 of Matthew 16. Messiah said, Who do people say the Son of Man is? Then verse 14. Well, they replied, um, Some say John the Baptist. Some say Elijah. Others say Jeremiah or one of the other prophets. Messiah asked the disciples, Who do you say I am? Simon Peter replied, You are the Mashiach. It would have been spoken in Hebrew, the Mashiach, the Messiah. The Son of the Living God. The Messiah replied, You are blessed. You are blessed, Simon Peter, son of Jonah, because my Father in heaven has revealed this to you. You did not learn this from any human being. And we know that uh, <clears throat> Simon Peter, through fear of man, denied the Messiah, didn't he, more than once when Messiah was on trial but after the Messiah appeared in his resurrected body and asked for something to eat Peter woke up then we go to Acts chapter 2 now Peter is appealing to his Jewish brethren who believed in only one true God by the way didn't they Right, Acts 2, verse 22, Peter says, bravely, <clears throat> people of Israel, listen, God publicly endorsed Jesus of Nazareth, the Mashiach, by doing wonderful miracles, wonders and signs through him, as you well know. But you followed God's prearranged plan with the help of lawless Gentiles as Romans. You nailed him to the cross and murdered him. However, God released this Mashiach from the horrors of death and raised him back to life again. For death could not keep this Mashiach in its grip. King David quoted this in the Psalms I know the Lord is always with me I will not be shaken for he is right beside me no wonder my heart is filled with joy and my mouth shouts his praises my body rests in hope you will not leave my soul among the dead or allow your Holy One to rot in the grave you show me the way of life and you'll give me wonderful joy in your presence so Peter is quoting King David's words here 
Acts 2, 28, 29, sorry. Dear brothers, think about this. David wasn't referring to himself when he spoke these words I've quoted, for he died and was buried. And his tomb is still here among us. But he was a prophet. He knew God had promised with an oath that he, God would sit one of David's own descendants upon the throne. David's throne. David was looking into the future and predicting the Messiah's resurrection. He was saying the Messiah would not be left among the dead. His body would not rot in the grave. And this prophecy was speaking of Messiah, the Mashiach, whom God raised from the dead. And we are all witnesses of this. Now, this Mashiach sits on the throne of the highest honor in heaven, at God's right hand. The Father, as the Father promised, gave to the Mashiach the Holy Spirit to pour out upon us, just like you hear and see today. For David never ascended into heaven, but David said, The Lord said to my Lord, Psalm 110, 110 verse 1, quoting, Sit at my right hand. Is that Psalm 110? Not quite sure about that. Um, yeah, Psalm 110 verse 1. Sit at my right hand until I humble your enemies, making them a footstool under your feet. So, Peter says, let it be clearly known by everyone in Israel that God has made this Jesus, this Mashiach, whom you nailed, both Lord and Mashiach, Messiah. Now Peter's words convinced them deeply, and they said to Peter and the other apostles, Brothers, what shall we do? Now imagine if Peter had gone on the platform and said, You killed God. You killed God. They would have said, Lock him away. Throw away the key. He's a nut job. The apostles did not believe in any trinity. They were raised on the Shema. Shema Israel. Yahuwah Elohim Hua Echad. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Beware of Trinitarians. They are the devil's agents. Shalom.